Hey guys, welcome back. And today I want to test my NVIDIA Quadro FX 4800 with some different editing programs. If you saw my last video, uh, I bought a, a workstation video card, $10 eBay card, uh, to improve editing in Premiere Pro CS55, which I've been using forever. No Creative Cloud for me. I'm going to stick with my old version. Uh, seems to be working so far. So today I want to test DaVinci Resolve and see if that's going to work with this uh, NVIDIA Quadro card and also HitFilm Express. So let's get to the computer and test these out. Okay guys, let's see what happens. See if we can get DaVinci Resolve running on this old NVIDIA Quadro uh, that we upgraded last week. Uh, first thing we're going to do is go to the Resolve website. Okay, so here if you scroll all the way to the bottom, you'll see the uh, Resolve and Resolve Studio. Studio is $300. Let's just do the free one, and we're on Windows. So we are going to download this. Um, I'm going to cut through this, and we'll see when we get the, get the file downloaded. Looks like it finished. So now let's double click the install file and see what happens. Looks like there's some options here. I'm just going to accept the default. And we'll watch the install and see what happens. Okay, looks like that finished. It says it installed successfully. Let's see what happened. I'm going to go ahead and allow access. Now, if I remember when I had my last uh, really bad GE Force GPU, it would never make it past a certain part when these loading screens. but I can't remember which one it was so let's uh, let's just watch it for a second and see what happens okay made it much further than with the last GPU so um, let's go ahead and uh, let's do a new project and let's call this one test Okay. Oh. Let's uh looks like we didn't make it. Okay guys, next we're going to try Hit Film Express and see how this works with the Nvidia Quadro FX4800, the $10 eBay card. I will do the update at a later time. So let's go ahead and do new. Sure, let's go for uh, the defaults here. Let's say OK. It is by no means fast, uh, but there we go. So now let's go ahead and uh, let's import couple of clips. Um, let's just pull up a, a finished YouTube video. Whoops. Looks like it's still uh, importing. So far so good. So let's go ahead and add that to our timeline. The editor sequence settings differ. Uh, sure. That's because I didn't shoot this one at 24 frames. I grabbed a, probably grabbed the wrong file, but um, let's go ahead and just look at this for a second. Um, let's just try uh, 
try a couple of editing tools. Let's try to put a slice in here. Let's just uh, maybe move it around a little bit, add another slice. Um, let's go ahead and grab. Sorry, I don't know how to use hit film yet. Um, let's go ahead and delete part of it. Then let's get back. And uh, let's pull these back. I think this is going to work, guys. At least the editing portion is going to work. 68.1.235 in the lab. Uh, we have a user, which is admin, and we have a password, which is the same, which Playback's is admin. Uh, uh, let's just try to add a effect. I don't know if I can do this, but let's just throw, let's throw an auto color on there. That seemed to work. Uh, on our lab. I Access think hit film's a go. Um, First thing we're going to do is I'm going to try and uh, just see uh, figure out how to use hit film a little better but hit film's a go on this GPU. Seems to be working fine. Uh, we're going to do more tests then with hit film since we uh, seem to be getting this working on this GPU, the $10 eBay GPU. Uh, let's uh, let's do some 4K tests in the future. Uh, I don't know how that's going to work out but Right now, HitFilm Express looks good. $10 GPU, eBay, success. DaVinci Resolve is a flop. So there you have it. So there you have it, guys. That's our test. Uh, no go on DaVinci Resolve. I have never been able to get that thing to run yet on any of my computers, but that's okay. Uh, HitFilm actually looks pretty good. I think I'm gonna try using that a little bit. I'll probably run through some more tests. Uh, maybe try to do some basic grading as soon as I learn how to do it and uh, and report back on that But yeah, right now hit film looks like it works pretty well with it. So uh, That's all we have for today. Uh, thanks for watching and we will talk to you next time